American and other friends and subscribers around the world. <laughs> you almost forgot that, didn't you? Yeah. No, never. What you doing, Miss Kitty? Yeah, I'm for firewood. Look around, we got a couple trees. Miss Kitty was checking out to see if there was a tamarack. It was dead back there. It turned out to be a piss fur. Our beer getting a little wood. Checking our fences. You need a hand, Miss Kitty? Nope, How about now? Hello. Oh. <laughs> oh, I saw my leave on you, but all right. Been all about firewood for the last. Actually, this week the weather changed on us. We had snow just up above the homestead, so uh, when I got to um, chopping that wood and splitting that wood. Thanks to some good friends of ours, Dave and Linda, let us borrow their, uh, they got two splitters, so Dave uh, told us we could use the one over at our place, so thank you, Dave and Linda. Man, that makes life so much easier. So we started, so I started splitting that, and now uh, we're going to find us some more to split. We just don't like to go back down the hill without a... Uh, out of load. Let's see if I'm going to see them on the screen, but that's the, the bull trout. It's the one we're uh, doing this to protect their spawning grounds. I just love seeing them. That's an Idaho native fish that is endangered and has been for some time. Just makes us feel so good to see them up in here. You know, our fish fence is a small part of bringing them back, but it sure makes us feel good, especially to see them coming back. You can see them down in there. I don't want to spook them too much, but they're up in there doing their thing. The other day when we were up here, they were down there fanning their beds and stuff, and they turned sideways. And you know, I haven't ever watched a fish pad of bed is pretty darn interesting. You see there's my fence goes across there. You can see them up there. Beautiful fish. One of my favorites. We always called them growing up and back when we could fish for them we called them Dolly Vardens. Same thing. Beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, well, must have been too much. It's great to see them in here. That's a good, probably nine inch fish. Another one went up under the log. There was three. Just wonderful. This kitty is making me, she thinks it looks like we're trying to joust people. When you come around a corner and the truck's coming towards you and their eyes are this big. Hmm. So she thinks that I should probably cut off uh, some of my dang tea people. Yeah, it's kind of long. I'm going to short it up a little bit with old trusty craftsman, which I don't think I've ever, after I bought this thing, ever uh, talked about it. Um, you know, because I got mad at the steels. Well, I'm kind of over that, so eventually I'd like to get me another, you know, big steel chainsaw. Or a Husqvarna. The Huskies are supposed to be good saws. But, uh, this one, man, what, it was on sale, what did I get this one for? 150 Yeah, I can't even remember. Man, it's, uh, um, it's been amazing. You know, real happy with it, other than I ran it into a, a fence, and tomorrow i got to pick me up a new chain, because fences do wonders to the to the saws. But other than that, we've been uh, super, super busy and saying we needed to get a, you know, do a video, and in a video for over a week or something. Just, I just don't even know what, why, or what we're so busy. It's just insane right now. <laughs> it just seems like we're go, 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 but really ain't getting nothing done. But between Miss Kitty working her 
You know, she's got a side job. She does three days a week, and then, you know, we're up here um, doing our fence line, our fish fence line. That's till the 15th of October, or it could go a little bit longer. Um, well, anything else you can think of, Miss Kitty? I want to make sure you cut this pole with the in the right spot. Oh, I get you. Yeah, there's a. So we're gonna put us a teepee in you know, a right lodge I wanna together keep eventually. This. You wanna keep that? That part, that's yeah, beautiful. that's pretty cool. Yeah, I'll either use this one for uh, one of our buildings, or eventually I'm gonna have me a a teepee out there on the property too. Um, been doing some building and stuff around there, and like I said, we've just been just crazy busy. Um, all you need to check out too, uh, my old buddy Bob. He had a couple of videos, and I told him I was going to mention him, so he'd best be getting some videos. And you should check him out at uh, cheap or uh, doing it doing it cheap. I was going to say cheaper and dirt. <laughs> that's a good place to buy ammo, <laughs> yeah. but uh, doing it cheap. Old Bob, man, he's a hoot. He he just cracks me up. But he's doing some videos and stuff, and been getting quite a few quite a few uh, views and stuff on uh, the Harbor Freight. He's been doing some showing some of their products and stuff like that. So maybe that's what I should be doing for craftsmen, for seers. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, so check out Doing It Cheap. Make sure you check out our our website. It's da I pretty much, I just made a few knives yesterday, or a couple of knives, finished up a couple of knives yesterday, and they're actually on eBay. Um, you know, get, check out our decals and shirts and all that on IdahoHillBilly.com. Check out Bob's if he needs some signs made up or something for Call Bob for signs. And anything else you can think of? Mm, nice piece of char. Yeah. Have to grab that. I'll take that too. Some char so I can do some forging. Other than that, I guess we uh, tell them about the and talk to the producers and stuff. I think. Yeah. yeah. Something comes of it. Yeah, <laughs> some cousin wait to talk about it. Yeah. So are we gonna cut this part out then? Maybe. I've <laughs> been talking to a few, a uh, couple of Hollywood producers again, and uh, I have a pretty good gut feeling about the the one we're talking. We really ain't, you know, I got another gal, but I don't get um, too excited. You know, we'll see see what comes of it or whatever, but. I don't know. Anyway, but other than just busy, real busy, and it's almost hunting season too. And the hills are packed now. We've seen more people up here today than I've seen up here in the hills all summer. So I'm gonna cut this off and make Miss Kitty happy, so we ain't jousting with other trucks. So we'll uh, check in later, I guess. We're back again. Cut back in here. I've been trying to get this video done for over a week. <laughs> been so dang, uh, you know, like I said, the other one's so dang busy that uh, we haven't even had time to go. We probably would have put a couple of short videos out, but haven't even had uh, time to get over to the kids to download those. So we thought we'd finish it off with almost a kind of a morning, a morning coffee, Saturday right? morning. It's all beautiful fall finally here. Yesterday we went treasure hunting and stuff down below and uh, it was uh, 92, yeah. 93 degrees yesterday. I finished off kind of an Indian summer thing going on here or something. Mm -hmm. um, sitting on our our new little deck that I, that I uh, built. This over here, um, right here I'm actually going to put a wall and then you can kind of see the framing and stuff up here. I gotta figure I'm gonna do some kind of funky thing to come off the gypsy wagon there and cover that up and get it so that you know Miss Kitty's out of the rain and snow and all that when she's bringing me my my grub. <laughs> <laughs> and then what about a cook cooking video, yeah, Miss Kitty? Yeah, uh, thanks for all the requests for the cooking videos. I just maybe maybe yeah. tomorrow you and Katie Joe could do it. Maybe tomorrow we're doing uh, oh Katie Joe and. Tim and little Tucker, Teen T, coming over and uh, 
Gonna do dinner and stuff here, so that might be a yeah, good maybe time. Cards, yeah, I'm trying to get everybody, all the kids over and stuff. We we love to play cards, especially this kitty. Loves to play cards and board games and play sequence. And I love sequence, so we're gonna try to actually sit down and do that. But Tim's uh, exhaust keeps falling off his his Jimmy. Timmy's Jimmy, so I'm gonna weld his exhaust on so it won't fall off no more. Well, it should about a Ford probably to fall off. <laughs> no one else will need something else that you're going to do right here. i got to fix it. We're looking at his chainsaw. His chainsaw is having some Change issues. Change on yours. Yep, Maybe and other... Look at the air compressor. Oh, yeah, my compressor's out. I you don't know about looking at it. I need to buy me a new compressor. Trials and tribulations on the homestead. So I've been hand nailing and hand screwing everything. <laughs> which a screw holds ten times better than a yeah. nail does any day. So, in the long run, that's... That's better, but I gotta score me another air compressor. So we were down treasure hunting yesterday, and we did alright. Down, we actually went down in uh, the flatlands and met up with Kevy D because we are now officially empty <laughs> nesters. Yeah. Kind of uh, was out making knives the other day, and Miss Kitty was doing her little side job thing. It's out here on the homestead, just me, and uh, you know, of course, when you're sand away and working or pounding on metal and stuff you just do a lot of thinking I didn't think I decided I didn't much like not having my boy right here but he's doing doing good yeah so he'll be down he's got him a little little actually I guess a kind of apartment thing but a room with a uh, um, friend yeah friend and almost like a daughter one of our other Polly's for daughter Sierra well, but uh, what else is I going to talk about out here? Ooh, it's rough. Look, look bright, huh? Yeah, it's way bright. When you turn, I can see my reflection. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and your hair's crazy. But uh, so anyways, we just wanted to do jump in here and finish off that video, man. We're just, you know, I try to. We think about a lot of times. I think about, oh, I should have probably filmed that and all that, and just crazy, crazy. It's just busy, man. Getting ready. The winter's coming, man. Fall's here. We're doing good on our firewood. Collection. Yeah, the firewood. We got, I don't know, I probably got four or five cords. You know, really, I'd like to have about 20. It sounds crazy, but I'd like to do it where I could stagger it, you know. And not worry about it. Yeah, I'm not, yeah, not worry about year. it. Right. And just kind of do it, but that's in due time. Yeah, I've got a few things to do in the cabin. Yeah, I got, I went down, I was going to get uh, some insulation yesterday, and there's so many treasures I ended up spending my my uh, my jingle in my pocket. I ended up spending on more treasures to try to make more money. So didn't get insulation yesterday. So hopefully I'll get that in the next week or two. So I can start. Cause I'm going to insulate the whole. You know, I got a little bit. This wall is insulated, and then side wall and stuff. But I need to do the ceiling and all that, and dug get all these roofs. I mean, it's just just insane busy. I think other than that, we're going to try to Skype with some folks today. Well, the internet service up here is uh, obviously on my property. <laughs> there is no internet service pretty much. Well, there is. There is, but it costs me. Well, my bill's 140 bucks or 120 bucks this month. So we're going to go over and try to Skype over at uh, Katie's or Cars today and talk to some Hollywood folks. See all that, how all that turns out. You know, right at, now that we're heading into winter, man, come come December, man, we're pretty, because we just all sit around the fire and talk. <laughs> There's a ton of snow. I think get out there and shovel That's off some roofs. It's a good time to antique. Mm -hmm, it is a good time to antique. We are stocking up on. You know, definitely that's what we were doing yesterday. We stocking mm -hmm. up on stuff to get listed. That uh, our website. Um, I know hillbilly.com. I'm kind of down on stuff. I gotta get some knives mm -hmm. and things on there. Yeah, it'd be nice to have that. Uh, Idaho hillbilly.com more productive. Yeah, we need to. Yeah, so check that out. Yeah, check it out. <laughs> well, we need. Yeah, I'd like to actually eventually be selling most of my goods on there. I mean, mm -hmm. some stuff you can't compete with eBay, but because it's a fit, you know, on your website, it's obviously whatever you put down is the price. Right, where eBay is an auction. Yeah. But you can always send me offers, too. Yeah. <laughs> I'm definitely, I'm going to say, oh, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, definitely. Definitely, definitely. But other than that, man, I think, uh, about all I got, I got to go 
make some knives, work on a couple of knives. Miss Kitty's got to do some shipping, and then we got to do some listing. we got to go over and, like I said, do this Skype thing over with the kids, so we'll download this. That's why I wanted to finish this one off with the um, kind of a morning coffee deal. What else is going on? Anything else we should share before we... It's two weeks since we did a lot, another video, I guess. The uh, haven't been doing much grouse hunting or nothing in the last mm -hmm. week. Of course, anytime I'm out in the hills, I was having a shot there. But. <laughs> All right, so I guess we'll have to just keep on keeping on. Y'all have a wonderful day and stay safe out there. Say bye bye, Miss Kitty. Miss Kitty. Kitty. <laughs>